Hello everyone, this is Wanyan Park. In this video, I'm going to go through SOLIDWORKS simulation, especially simply supported beam bending case. So, uh, in homework 10, you can see case 2B is that. So, here I'm starting with a long box which has 10 mm by 10 mm cross section and 100 mm length. So, as you know, we have SOLIDWORKS simulation tab here. Let me open new study. Click this one. So I'm going to stay a static option and click it. So here we have SOLIDWORKS simulation tree. So first one is for applying material properties and second one is connection and third one is fixture. We are going to apply the boundary conditions. The fourth one is external loads, which uh, allows to us to apply um, the forces. And fourth one, uh, the last one is meshing. Okay, so let me start with this here. So right click on that and then apply. So here, this is material property windows. I'm looking for 6061 aluminum alloy. So here. So apply and close. And then next one is fixture. So in order to apply simply supported supported the beam, simply support, so we need uh, some special feature which called split function. Okay? So because uh, that's simply I would like to apply that simply support on the mid plane of this beam. Okay? So let me go to uh, right click on fixture and advanced fixtures here. Once I click this, we can see here the type and split. So let me go into split tab. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to split this surface as two. Okay. So click here, create, create sketch. Okay. And then let me click this surface. All right. And then here, click, uh, click the line, and then find uh, the mid midpoint of this edge, and here midpoint. Okay, and then escape. So now I have this line, and then as exit sketch. Okay, so and in here the lower part parts you can see create split. So hit this button, and then now I have the separated two surfaces. Okay. So let me uh, zoom out and then rotate it. So I'm going to do same process. So create sketch and then go to sketch tab and click this one line and then click this surface and then find midpoint and then midpoint and hit escape button and then exit sketch here create split so now let me go to back go back to uh, the type tab so now uh, here i have to edit here this box so i would like to select the edge this edge not this face okay just one one more click okay and then rotate this model and then let me find one more edge so these two edge gonna be uh, simply supports okay so now uh, I have to choose one the reference plane so like that and then just click these three buttons so now and then click this one so now this gives uh, this two edge should be uh, should be fixed for the, the degree of three degree of free, three translation degree of freedom at that edge. Okay? And then same procedure, the act uh, add uh, the forces and meshing. Okay? 